Hello and welcome back to XCOM 2. I apologize for the delay in getting this video out. I have spent the last day or so uh, uninstalling and reinstalling the game and redoing all the config files. Ah, uh, clearing up my save game folder because the game would not load at this point here, but it looks like it's finally back up and working. Ah, uh, so we're finally going to push through, defeat the alien menace and go on our ways. Uh, I have absolutely no idea what I was doing. I think we've got a mute on here who's going to lead the charge for us. Let's have uh, James Dean come forward. He looks like he's in front of the pack here. My we'll just uh, this great blue move up with James Dean here. Have an overwatch trying to get the rest of the team caught up. And vulnerable. Uh, Shadow dash forward. Move, move. Uh, Ripple, thank you as well. No one's got any ammo. I shall fix that next turn. We march Farkas like forward. thunder on Who's the this beachy? to right the um, wrongs of old. Someone's been about and blown up all the cover. If we move Jessica forward, beachy can have that spot. <laughs> Good enough. Get up there, beachy. Ah, uh, we have Mr. Vlood. Ah, uh, you've actually got ammo. Oh, uh, well, you can't get forward far enough to overwatch. Let's dash you. Hasten there. your deeds. Uh, Rosa, get over here with the rest of the team. Dash forward. Sisters, march! And Mr. Commander, let's bring you up. You can have an overwatch standing out in the open. Muton Pyro. Uh, let's bring you. Just here, hang out with the team. Tell them a story about your life on your filthy alien planet. Oh, that's gross. He's full of poison as well. Don't you poison the rest of the team standing there. Thank you. Alright, so we'll blue move up with everyone, get everyone reloaded. And then maybe send our muton forward into battle. You can hear the alien break and stuff. They're furious that we've invaded their base. Right, reload, Shadow. Whoops. Uh, zoom in. Zoom out. There we go. Remember my shortcut buttons. Uh, James Dean, let's bring you up. Hold fast. Uh, Ripple Snake, completely out of ammo. Let's bring the commander up. He can peek through the window. Uh, this muton here might be breaking. I don't know when be this turn, I suppose, couldn't it? Uh, let's bring it blued here into this little bit of cover. Overwatch from here. We'll just send our muton Something running forward counts. to try and alert stuff. Stand ready. Uh, Rosa, come peek through the window this side. Sisters of battle reporting. Uh, we got Ripple Snake needs to uh, move up and reload. Once again, stand where Jessica's standing. Seems she gets all the best ground. She's full of ammo. We can just dash her up over here. Uh, Beachy is also full of ammo. Let's get you dashing forward. Hold on. Ripple Snake up and reload. Ready for battle. Farkas coming forward and reloading. I smell some ammunition! Alright, Mr. Muton, what say you came charged up here? What could you see for us? Oh, Shadow! That's our Muton! <laughs> here we go. Give it a little bit of motivation to get up there. Right, looks like the mind control is going to hold and doesn't look like we've seen any alien. Um, so everyone's full of ammo now. Let's send this guy up to try and alert something. Doesn't have the best uh, movement range this Muton, does he? Oh, we can see nothing. Let's have James Dean-40 He's full of reaction fire. Should the Muton break? Uh, as is Shadow. Let's bring you forward. Uh, Ruffle Snake and Farkas at the back need to get racing forward. 
Jessica, you've got the uh, stun gun whoop, readied. I don't know where that click went. It didn't go off at all. Fantastic. I really wish it wouldn't cut away like that. My speed is better. Uh, Beachy. I know you can stop it from showing those sort of action scenes, but I think they look magnificent. I just wish it would give you some warning it's going to do it when you mid-click. Uh, Vlood, forward we come. Just keep everyone grouped up here. Okay, the dramatic music started to play. I got the music down very low. I found it was quite loud in a couple of episodes. So if people want the uh, dramatic music a bit louder, just give me a yell. That Ruffle, you're so slow, Ruffle Snake. Where's your sprint? Uh, well, let's get you, say, there. It's good enough. It's not particularly good cover, but it'll do. Right, so the mine control holds. We've got an Archon Prime. Viper. Pair of Vipers. Tough it out, Shadow. Thank you. Once again, another uh, little pod. I don't know what the aliens are playing at. They should have brought all their uh, gatekeepers and rift keepers and things. These uh, little forces just aren't going to cut it against the team, I don't think. I actually saw a codex up the back there. You can see its legs sticking out. So we might actually dash forward with the muton again. What's this? It's another snake? Snake, 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 snake. Alright. Tough it out, Shadow. No! Back away. Our soldiers are suffering out there. We'll need <laughs> to give them some time to recover when we get back. Oh, the berserker up the back as well, dancing about. Rosa looking sharp. Commander. Good. No Good, no pity at all. I love this crazy house they've built for the humans. Oh, you're not going to put down the mute on that easy. You can gloriously charge into battle for us. Oh, that game's struggling. The uh, mods sure have put a... Uh, fearsome strain upon the system. Where are we going to go, Muton? Do we come? Let's go alert the Codexes as well, bring them in. Ah, oh, Jessica! <laughs> Muton trying to sneak away. Ah, uh, she's not having any of it. Uh, James Dean, you've got an Archon. The snake's probably a bit more dangerous, we don't want people getting pulled up. And that is a poor miss, James Dean. Travesty. travesty indeed, sir. One dodge, one hit. So let's go again on it. Oh, right. Make it hard work of it, I see. Uh, Shadow. Don't know what we'll do about you, Mr. Ripple Snake. I'd like to get you forward. We can see something. Good shots from here. Okay, I'm going. I think I probably want you on the Archons. You've got a bit more damage. Chain shot, 73%. I like those odds. Go, a bit of shred. Ow. The aliens dodging left and right. Oh, he was a prime. Watch out, Riffle Sake. They're shooting back. Seriously, is that the best you can do? Ah, uh, Farkas. I'll probably try and get you with Jessica. I'll bring Jessica up to the front lines. She does have the stun gun ready to, to uh, fire anything that closes on her. Oh, speaking of things that get close, double rift keeper. And four codexes and two archons, okay. And now a mighty chrysalid. Well, I had uh, laughed at the aliens for bringing the force they'd brought. But that force looks a bit. It's a bit too tough, isn't it? Um. What are we going to do with this? Uh, 
Let's guess these three, shall we? Come on. This is horrendous. Uh, double rift keep. We've got to get up there and get that down somehow. I am unsure how at the moment. Uh, that's why, Jessica. Mr. I think he's going to thrash you for that girl. You should be on stage with the Bolshoi. Okay, uh, Beachy, you are going to be key. I want you in this corner here so you can shoot at the Grand Eyeball's Doom. Actually, that spot there will do. Go right, go right. You've got all the shredding. And Mr. Beachy needs to learn his left from right. Let us do this! Oh, what was that, Vlood? I was trying to try to stick Farkas. Let's bring Vlood up here then. Well, I am starting to panic and things are going wrong. Rosa Griffin, uh, shoot a snake for me. Double Rift Keeper, huh? Hi. I'm, um... No, somewhat unsure of how to go about it. Right. Put him down. Well done, Rosa. Uh, Commander, you've got the mind control ability. Could we mind control that mighty crystal there to go fight the Rift Keeper for us? Ah, uh, it's got one turn. But that is an option. Dimensional Rift. Chuck that up there. That's a good time filler for the time being. Whoops, the Viper Prime's having a go. Oh, Jessica, get out of the explosion bubble. I know you want to charge the alien, but now is not the time. Uh, Shadow, let's turn on. Let's not turn on armor mode. I think that muton's going to break this turn, so let's bring Shadow here, park her next to it. Uh, we can see the chrysalid, we can see an explosive barrel, let's fire an explosive barrel, get some free damage. The rest of the shots are pretty lousy. And Farkas, we can run and gun forward. We can't really get close enough to deal with these snakes, can we? That shot there will give us a flank. Let's get up there. Why, my ancestors! Do we have to watch the berserker part at the back as well? Well done, Farkas. That's another dealt with. Uh, from here, you get a non-movement action. We can teamwork. Vlood, I don't think that's really worth it. Let's just hunker down. Okay, so we're going to get up there and save Jessica, who's in a world of trouble. Come on, sort your turn out, alien. Whoops, he's got the flank on Farkas. Farkas doesn't mind. Using the shield the to be butted. Teleporting Muton, I saw you. What sort of nefarious play is that? Alright, there's all the codexes coming in. They're going to be troublesome. Flanking around and shooting the team. Um, Double Rift Keeper, I'm still... Less than confident in the team here. Good. Oh, Jessica. It's all right. I don't mind the codex is stacking more bombs and things there. I'm sorry, what are you having another go for, mate? I suppose that was his turn. He might have been uh, having an extra turn poison damage. Is that how the primes work? Hard to tell. That's the way, Jessica. Kick him in this bubble. And backflip. Or at least cunningly escape the explosion. Some kind of human enclosure? reports of missing civilians years before the first invasion could this be them maybe they had planned to use this for some sort of I love this picture of the sick the way he had taken his chrysalid for a walk 
I think he had his wang out, didn't he? Where's that picture? Oh, Farkas charging at the enemy once more. That's not helpful, Farkas. Right, the summons. Summoning things at the back of the map. That's all right if we can manage to fall back. Um, double Archon Inferno Viper. Don't you panic, Shadow. Thank you. You've got to go save Farkas. This is looking like a bit of trouble. Um, we may have bitten off more than we can chew here. You know who I blame in this situation? Bradford. We had a whole ship full of capable soldiers we could have brought. But instead he's decided to leave them behind rather than assaulting the alien base with everyone. Foolish play, Bradford. If humanity falls, here it's on you. If we win, it's on me. <laughs> right. Get back in the bubble. Right, some free cheeky damage up there. Removes a lot of the cover they can use. I'd like to get some more cover removal in here. Right, Berserker, Berserker, thanks Farkas, that's your fault. Uh, what are we going to do? We need to get Farkas freed and he's way over there. Let's have a shadow uh, turn on armor mode. Why that cripple your movement? Well, let's come here. Maybe James Dean can go save Farkas. Ah, uh, that was horrendously poor. Let's shoot this Muton that we've lost control of. Good effect. Ah, James Dean. That's right. Ripple Snake. I thought we were on James Dean. Uh, right, Spectre's very dangerous. We've got a standard rocket we could fire up here. Take out some of the cover. Hopefully, James D can get some shots up there. Right, bit of damage there. We missed the spectre at the back. Uh, Beachy, too far from the grand eyeballs of doom. So shoot this guy. Right, give him a bit of poisoning. What are you gonna do now that you're poisoned? Oh, no chance, son. No chance. Uh, I'm, I'm surprised you haven't got something better to do, to be honest. And let's poison that Archon up there as well. I'm surprised you cannot see that crystal up there. Uh, Mr. Vlood, let's bring you around here. Can you see the crystal lid? Can. Let's try insanity. Tremble in fear before the son of Sigma and the Empire. All right, if we can panic him or mind control him, I'm happy. Whoa! All right, we got a big fella go help us out. Uh, Rosa Griffin, let's move you up to here. Just about to see uh, Farkas. Spectre, forty-six on that snake is garbage. Let's go with the Spectre. Uh, we could mind control the Viper, or the Archon Prime. I don't think they're actually very good targets, to be quite honest. Um, can't get up to get the eyes, we'll hit that Prime there. Worry about this guy. 
really unsure what to do here. We've got to get pushed up so we can start getting these things down, which is going to rely a lot on Beachy with his shred. We've used all the frost bombs, so we don't have that luxury, but we do have some mind control to toss about. Uh, James Dean, you can eye up the Spectre. Have got good shots from here. Not bad, 83. And if we, again, you could possibly put him down. Love it. Right, one down, two down. Fantastic. Do we have to go free Jessica as well somehow before she gets strangled to death? Seems Jessica yeah, was in that circle. Gobbles, a lot of you. Uh, if we could actually fire up some of these berserkers, make them uh, rampage about, we might be able to do something. This is another pod coming in. Archon, Archon, Archon. There are some Archons about, it seems. Well, the aliens are defending their base nicely. Crystal had drawn fire. Perfect. Hopefully we'll have control of him and he can go racing forward into that uh, mess there. There's quite a number of aliens to deal with. He's going to make a mighty frontline tank up there. He can be able to grab that fire starter prime from bring the commander over. He's a good beefy lad with a uh, fair bit of hit points and defense. But I'm pretty sure we cannot actually mind control the Rift Keepers, though we shall find out if they're going to dash forward like that. That's crazy play from him. Why aren't you doing that, standing back and summoning the Rift? Alright, another chrysalid. Right, don't stand for it, James Dean. Ah, uh, he's gone off in shame. You realise he summoned him in the wrong spot. James Dean's just handling it. Right. <laughs> so many aliens. What are we going to do about this nonsense? You're right, my poor Chris will catch the fire. It's alright, he's just a meat shield. Ah, blazing pinions, that's gonna be disgusting. There goes all the cover we're using. Um Fall back team, fall back. Bradford, we might be in need of a pickup here. What's that, Bradford? You didn't plan to evac us? You fool. You absolute fool, Bradford. Not only did you not send us enough soldiers, but you haven't thought of an escape plan. Right, that guy's enraged. Fantastic. The alien doing half the job for us. Right, 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 right. Um, whoops, spin the camera a couple of times. Just to really confuse people. I don't know what we're doing there. Uh, let's start with the obvious moves. Mr. Beachy. Thrash this thing here with all your might. What Illyrium poisoning is working on them. Nice. Tell you what, why don't you light him up? Go. He's got so much armor to try and chew through. Uh -oh. Alright, shred for six. It's okay, a couple more turns we can get through that. Uh, we've got the acid bomb. 
Actually, your advanced feedback will uh, go straight through his shields, I believe, won't it? Ignoring armor. The armor is too strong for you. Yeah, six damage is fine. It's fine. Uh, we need to get Farkas freed and Jessica freed. Let's bring Rosa Griffin over here. Good shot on the side of the bow. We have to hit that bow a couple of times to actually free Farkas from his grasp. Not that one. Uh, not that one. What is that thing taking cover behind? Who knows? We've got to get in there. Now's not the time for that, Rosa. Um, Commander, you are in fact uh, useless against the Rift Keeper. Your gun does not shred. Let's bring you forward. And we'll use you to mind control something up there. Yeah, we can't grab the Rift Keepers. Uh, no. Try and grab that arc on there. Beautiful. That gives another frontline meat shield up there. Chrysalid. Uh, not him. Can you actually go free a JLR from one of the snakes? Is that the one with Jessica? I think it is. Slash him. It's so hard to tell. I really wish. They would fix their snakes pulling things through cover and then everyone just ending up randomly about the map. Shadow, you're not helping. Oh, ten, leave him alone, eh? Did you kill him, Shadow, and break my game? I think he's still going. But he's missed. Ah, <sighs> James Dean, you've got to move. There's all sorts of garbage going on there. Let's uh, spin you over this side here. We've got that chrysalid hunter there that we can deal with. But you need to reload. Well, reload. I can blast once again. Shadow, let's bring you forward here. Shoot that chrysalid hunter. Twelve. Not enough to put him down, huh? Left him with one health. I don't think he's poisoned or anything. Rather annoying. Shadow, what are you doing? So I'm just hoping the game uh, keeps running here. Okay. I don't want to have to uh, try and load anything here. It's gonna go uh, poorly, I would think. We can get that guy. We can get uh, this Archon up here. Is a bit of a nuisance, isn't he? Riff it to him. Right, Twenty-two damage is magnificent. He's got his frenzy on. Uh, Farkas and JLR can't do anything. All we gotta do is wait. Right, the Illyrium poisoning doing a good job, just ticking down on things. Well done, James Dean. Beachy. Lovely, you can give him poisoning as well. What's he doing? Summoning the rift? Don't know. <laughs> oh, it's taken so long to process all the attacks. Just too many aliens. Too many aliens. Whack. Oops. 
So, if you're into XCOM gambling now, it's time to place your bets as to whether or not the team will live. I know where the smart money's going. Ooh, all right. That's James Dean firing about the place. Breaking it down into manageable sized clumps. That's okay. Duck Shadow. Q. 69% chance to hit. That seems quite high, doesn't it? Alright, Berserker rampaging about. Whoa, Rosa. Watch yourself. I heard that. Ah, oh, Shadow Stun. That's no good. No good at all. I found the snake taken to the high ground. Quite cunning play. Alright, rift. Alright, one codex, that's fine. We can deal with that. Nice work. Perfect place to deal with these rifts. And again. This is what I don't like is the two summons per turn. It's just too much with this mod setup. Work. <laughs> Look at him. He's collapsed. Gross. Dean takes a nasty shot. We gotta get the stun on him, that's the way. Right! The Archon coming under fire. Inferno Viper sneaking around. Watch out, James Dean! Oh, the increased damage on you is absolutely diabolical. We need to get Jessica back in there. Ready to heal. It's going to go very badly if these codexes decide to teleport behind our lines and start firing away. Medic. As get a medic over here. James Dean's been killed. Absolutely themselves. terrible. Uh, that was a lot of our firepower just gone right there. Uh, Riffle Snake, um, there's not much we can do with you, is there? You just have to fire away. Fire away, sir. Yeah, baby. Ah, oh, Beachy, we've got all sorts of things going on. You have to concentrate on getting down this Rift Keeper. I know there's all sorts of things flanking around behind you, but we can't worry about that for now. Have to use Vlue to take care of that, I think. Right. Good work. Uh, he's nearly out of armor. This sectoid soldier is 14 health. Can't, can't believe you can't see him there. Uh, we can fire the Null Lance in. Beachy. Oh, the dream team. Blue and Beachy, is that wow, what we've been missing? Ah, cool. uh, right, Rosa. You really need to free Farkas here. I don't know what the snake's taking cover behind. I just wish they would fix the where is the snake when it's binding people through cover. To the heretics. And, uh, shoot him again. Is 
just have to ignore this berserk in front of you. We need Barkus freed up. And we still have not done enough damage there. Now let's have the command up fire up here on this bloke. Not the dodge, we need things down. Uh, you mate, I want you to come, melee attack. No. See, I don't even know where the snake is. We need to be standing next to it to melee attack it, and I don't know where the snake is. Is it here? It looks like it could be there, doesn't it? Let's assume it's here. Burning! You can still use the melee attack. Ah, uh, yes, but we're not standing next to the snake, which is... Absolutely infuriating. Where is this guy standing? There, back where we were. Yeah, hit like gobbles, a lot of you. <sighs> Some missions just don't go right, do they? We nearly threw the armor on the first Rift Keeper, but. With uh, so much of the team tied up, I don't know that there's much we can do. Ah, uh, Jessica's no longer bound. She's escaped. She's got one health. Uh oh. Watch out, Jessica. Oh, this is a sad ending, isn't it? Backflip, Jessie. <laughs> I hope my eye can't be going to draw all the fire. No! <laughs> Alright, Rosa coming under fire. She's doing good. Don't you think about it. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Do it all she can to save herself. No! Oh. <laughs> Watch yourself, Jessica. Oh, Jessica killed an action as well. Oh, it's gone wrong. It's all gone wrong. Right, more things being summoned in. <laughs> it's just too many alien. Right, Crystal and Hunter coming in. We lost the medic, we lost our crowd control. Having frontline DPS. Tied up. Oh, triple sectoid. You're winding me up. There's too much stuff. Just too much stuff. I can't believe I spent an entire day getting this. Up and running just for this massacre to occur.
Right, we're gonna fight to the last man here. Whoa, well done, Ripple Snake. It's a shooting gallery, and I'm the duck. Right, Codex sneaking about. Watch out, Vlood. Too many engineers! Right, Commander takes a few. Come on, Shadow, you need to recover. I don't, know, I don't know how to get up there and get him. Right, Ripple Snake, just turn around and fire. I know you're surrounded by all sorts of alien filth. But uh, start with the closest things, like this guy. Good. Who's next? Uh, everyone is next, Ripple Snake. Everyone's next. Ah, uh, Beachy, reload. What if you gave this guy both barrels seeing he's got his hole open for you? Just slip it in there, Beachy. Eleven. Oh, that's pitiful. Sorry, sorry. Absolutely pitiful. Ah, Vlood. Soul fire this codex here, it's got little health. Good man. It was a shot blessed by Sigma himself. Oh, uh, Rosa, we really need you to shoot this snake here. Reload. Stitches of battle, reporting. Shoot this accursed snake. I don't even know where it's standing, which is the most infuriating part. You can't get around and flank them or anything. I just think that's the sort of thing that the developers of the game would patch, because that's been happening since day one. The snake pulls someone through cover, the snake takes off, the person takes off, and they just end up randomly somewhere. Ah, uh, well, this mega dimensional rift we can fire again. Get in there, confirm. Just do it, Commander. Right, good bits of damage. Let's go for the uh, Viper up there. Avenge poor Jessica. Good man. What about the tournaments indeed? Ah, uh, me Archon mate, let's get out of this circle, let's come forward. Charge over here. <laughs> Farkas is getting cuddled to death. Go on Farkas, we need you freed mate. Right, blazing pinions. We get throwing that on Farkas of the Archon and your snake. Well, that's fine. Oh, I can't believe how badly this is going. Backflip. It's the way. We are under attack. And there's so many enemies. Right, 
Right, more summons incoming. Right, the armoured Psy Viper. Backflip, Commander. Takes five, that's alright, dodging diffly out of the way. What are you looking at? Alright, Inferno Viper sneaking up. Another arc, I'll just. They're just running all over the show. Right, Archon takes a couple. We need that Archon to live. He's going to try and slap this bow around the free Farkas. Oh, Commander, don't you get crit for seven. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Oh, now poison and covered in goo. Nine damage. Oh, this is despicable. Oh, Rosa. <laughs> Just about kidnapped at the last second here. Right, more sectoids sneaking about. Oh, my Archon's down. Okay. So, this is disastrous. <laughs> right, Shadow's back on her feet. Uh, you, you're too late, Shadow. Uh, we need you to come and deal with this abductor here. Uh, we can flank him from that spot there. You've got no bullets in your gun. Affirmative. Moving out. Ah, uh, back away indeed. It's coming out. Let's turn on armor mode. Hopefully that makes you immune to stun and it's reload. Locked and loaded. Ah, uh, ripple sake from here. There's all sorts of things flanking you. Let's worry about the sectoid. Drill him. Lovely. Elvis has left the building. At least ripple sake's having himself a good day out. Uh, right, no, no, yes, keep firing, Beachy. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, we're nearly through his armour. Good. Vlued, uh, insanity on the chrysalid. Can you mind control it? If so, a great day for all. Panicked him, that's fine as well. Off he goes, Beachy fires in. At the lightning oh, reflex, of course. I, mean, I don't even know why they bother giving me this stuff. It's pointless. Mad. Uh, Vlood from here. Let's fire. 39% chance to hit Vlood. You can sneak an acid bomb on that codex there. Does it do anything to the codex? I don't know that it does. Let's go for the Rift Keeper. Three, and it should be ticking with acid. Rose Griffin, we need Barkus freed so we can start shotgunning his way through things. Ah, uh, still hasn't let him go. <laughs> Absolutely disastrous. Surely this time. Ah, uh, Mr. Commander, let's back off somewhere. Uh, it's far the null luck. Can we also get, hit that codex there, finally killing it? However, I think it's too little too late. Far too little. Far too late. Ah, uh, Farkas. Alright, the sectoid abductor is dangerous. So let's work on that, I suppose, as the highest priority That's target. Majority. Right, good bit of damage. Oh, 
Pop him. That's the way. This is what we've been missing. An angry fark has to rip through the alien forces. Um, got shield, Rocky. Right, Commander takes a couple from the poisoning. Rift Keeper burning from acid, taken from the poison. Right, the Archon's pinions have missed everything. He won't be happy about that. Shadow firing wildly at the Archon as he races no in. Time to sit around. Get ready to try again. Come on, Farkas. We need to avoid those sort of hits. And these sort of hits. <laughs> ah, love it. No, no chance, Codex. Commander's too good for you, but we've got no mid kits to get your um, crystal poisoning solved. Ah, oh, Shadow takes one. She's immune. Fantastic. Take another one, Shadow. That a girl. Oof. Shit! Back away! Oh, Ro oh, don't get stunned, Rosa. Oh, the command takes nine. Commander not having a good day out. Flame snake blown away. Good work, Shadow. Drop. Oh, the Rift Keeper's on the assault. Watch out, Beachy. He's coming for you. Oh, he's got his tentacles out and all. There we go, don't stand for his nonsense. Oh, wait for the tentacle grab. Try to draw you inside his hole. Alright, another summons. What have we got this time? Right, a chrysalid hunter killer. Shadow racing in there. Right, I think, I don't know whether I'm going to have the Rift Keepers next campaign. If I do, I think I'm going to adjust them to only be able to do that once per turn, because this is quite frankly silly. If there was a set max number of things they could have summoned on the field, like five enemies or something, and then just keep re-summoning up to the max of five or something, it would work nicely. But just as it is, with this summon after summons after summons, with two of them, we just can't keep up. Shadow, you're going the wrong way. We need this crystal and things down so Ripple Snake can fire his mighty gun at things. Um. Well. What do we do about this? Oh, Ripple Snake, well done. You're having a champion day there. We can't kill them all, Dory. We need a way out. Farkas is panicked. Uh, oh, that was going to be taking care of this chrysalid here, Shadow and Farkas. And then Ripple Snake was going to shoot the big eye. Beachy was going to finish it off. It was going to be glorious. But my plan is not going to work. Instead, we have Shadow Bound, Farkas panicking. Ripple Snake, you cannot start your turn next to that thing. Come stay next to this thing, I suppose. It's the only 
spare bit of space we can get to. I, this Rift Keeper. Right, 18 damage, good. Marcus, you've got over your panic. Well done, sir. Oh, going for the junk. Brutal, Farkas. Brutal. Why did you stop your panic? Is it because you panicked on their turn? So when it came to our turn, and it's finally got one turn of panic, it's ended straight away? If so, I continue that that continent bonus we got is the most disappointing. Oh, good man. Uh, Beachy, we need the Rift Keeper down. Let's bring you to here. You're flanked by a couple of things, but uh, it's the way it goes, isn't it? Uh, what if we use your gun of infinite ruination here? Hit that Rift Keeper, the other Rift Keeper, the snake. Remove the cover so Vlood can get shots in. Uh, Mr. Vlood. Sacred Wrath! I was expecting a bit more than that, Vlood. Um, Commander needs to reload. Uh, you can't see the correct eye, either. Uh, you got a flank shot on that armoured Psy Viper. Take that shot. Oh, he's missed the Commander here. Absolutely useless. Covered in poison. He's going to die. There's nothing we can do about it for now. Just Thank needs to you. tough it out. Shadow being captured is surrounded by codexes. Sustain? No, it's down to one health. I think it's still going to use its sustain once we remove that one health that it's got. Which is infinitely the annoying. The gunner knows I'm the biggest threat. Oh, come on. You're real worthless, mate. What are we going to do? Oh, I think humanity is doomed. Watch out, Farkas. Right, Vlood smashed in the back. That's fine. Vlood doing okay. This guy on one health still managing to summon things in. Just devastating. Just devastating. Right. 188 hit points of extra things to kill. Well, combined with that snake there, 208. It's just too much for the team to handle. He's got his teeth. Oh, ripple snakes in, <laughs> snake in stasis. Ah. Uh. Why would you do that, you horrible Rift Keeper? I hate them so much. <laughs> Help me! I know, fuck. It's, it's, it's not going good, is it? Beachy. Put him down, that's the way.
Volkmar's beard. <laughs> I've never known such pain. Come on, Flu, just tough it out. Tough it out a little longer. You too, Farkas. Don't get... Right. So, Beachy's going to have to shoot that thing. Go for it. Can't believe that Ripple Stakes Stace is there. An absolutely filthy play from the big eyeball. Right, Beachy. Uh, no. Are you going to tell me you can't even see the one that's got... That's absolutely horrendous. You can't see this thing. Uh, right, well, let's shoot the Rift Keeper then. As part one of the plan. He's going to use stasis, isn't he? Terrible play. Hopefully the Illyrian poisoning will tick down on him. And let's try and save Vlood here. Ah, uh, Vlood, let's insanity on. The Muton Prime would be a good target. On mind control. No. Beachy, looking sharp. Good work, Beachy. Are you still alive? You are joking. Oh, now my camera's broken. No, no, we're going. No, we're not. Yes, we are. We're away. Uh, Flu, you have to move, mate. Um, over the back we're here, there's still that now. sectoid sneaking about. Finally. Uh, Shadow. We need to shoot the snake there. God, that's the one that's holding Shadow. We need to hit the shot. Good. Good, free Shadow. Shadow, move out of that explosion. Uh, Commander, you are absolutely worthless, mate. Mind control there. No. Yes. Let's mind control the armoured Cyviper. I mean, the commander's not going to last very long. He's down to five health or something stupid. But at least he might be able to give us some glimmer of hope. Uh, Shadow, fall back, reload. We've still got Illusion Protocol. Just haven't been in a position to throw it where it's going to do anything. Um... Chuck a grenade up here. There, hit those two. That's fine. Uh, we'll send the illusion protocol up there somewhere to try and put it up there. Oh, what, what a day. Right, the Viper there takes nine, fantastic. Poison, panic. That's the sort of thing we like. <laughs> All right, just just hurry up. Have your turn. Right, the muton prime here, panicking and racing about. Right. 
10 points on the decoy. It's alright, it's a shot the team didn't have to take. Here's another one. Fantastic work, decoy. That thing there is still firing at the commander. He's doing good keeping that one thing busy. Still going, draw one more. Well, that's a fairly good use of that, I think. But uh, too, a little too late. Backflip, Rosa. No, nope, no good. Now, yeah, Riffle Snake's been stunned. Disgusting. This thing here is still on one health. I'm. Ah, oh, just really unhappy with it. I think the Rift Keeper has been the big the big negative of the campaign. Uh, where the aliens are concerned. I think it's probably fine when you've got the usual uh, sort of base game where you can one-shot the monsters as they come in. You just have your sniper just picking off the monsters that come in while everyone else deals with the Rift Keeper in a couple of turns. But here, where the enemies are sort of designed... Well, as I have them to stay, stay alive for, you know, sort of three turns for a longer gunfight. It just means every turn they're consistently summoning in more and more and more troops that will never be able to work their way through. Ah, oh, and then these snakes hitting with the time oh, every time. No! That's been devastating, losing uh, Farkas and Jessica early on. There was a lot of firepower and the healing. We are under attack. Do not lose heart. And no matter what I do, I can't seem to get them free to just have a turn or two with We're them. Start clearing fire. up these three hit point things they're lying about. Ah, oh, the command's gone down. Another needless sacrifice, like so many others of your kind. If only you had listened. We a sad end to the campaign, the Rift Keepers, I think, the winner on the day. The two of them in tandem just summoning in far too much for the team to handle. Hopefully with Bradford still in control of the Avenger there, he'll be able to assemble a new team and we can take the fight to the alien forces once more. But for now, this campaign is lost. So I'm going to throw together another mod collection. Uh, where you get rid of the dual wield pistols and the dual wield swords. Apart from that, I don't really know what else I'm going to do. I'm going to go for sort of more aliens, less hit points on everything. Sort of play the game a bit more sort of fast and action oriented. I hope you'll join me for the next campaign. I'm going to do a mod video first up. Uh, so if you want a character for the new campaign, you can chuck your name and stuff in that. Hope you'll join me for it. I've been Mr. Gruffle. This has been XCOM 2. Can you believe they don't even have a cinematic for the loss? Where's the aliens having a big dance party and celebrating and having fun and humanity collapsing?